Uh, how much money should black Californians receive after centuries of mistreatment? Today, economists told the state's reparations task force the number could top $800 billion. That's two and a half times California's annual budget. And they say those calculations don't cover everything. CBS 13 Shante Passmore is getting answers on the other disparities the task force says need to be addressed. I want to talk about the most significant harm, and that is they took away who we are. Can America make atonement for its dark history of slavery and the mistreatments of black people fighting for freedom? I was born in the cotton field. I was raised in the cotton fields. 80-year-old Bishop Henry Williams lived in the South. Now living in California, he knows he's only a few generations away from when his great-grandfather was enslaved. Please go ahead. You have two minutes and please speak into the mic. The California Reparations Task Force met with economists to discuss payments, but what determines how much money should eligible black Californians get? So far, the experts say they examined health harms, housing discrimination, and incarceration rates and over -police. Policing. An AP article report it could cost the state $800 billion for payouts. However, a task force spokesperson refuted those claims, saying no dollar figure has been presented yet. Well, reparations, when it comes to my mind, I think of the term repair. It's the operable term in reparations. For the task force, restitution is part of reparations. It is not reparations. We were just talking about Racial Justice Act and how that could totally turn around the criminal justice system and it may not have any financial implications but it could have a dramatic implications on how many African Americans are ended up in the over incarceration of black people in the criminal justice system. Once the task force submits its final report, do you think that state lawmakers have an appetite to look at some of the harms to even look at some of the financial compensation recommendations? Um, right now, even now, um, elected officials and legislators in the Senate and the Assembly are anxious to look at the harms. The clock is ticking. A final report for lawmakers is due by June 30th.